Hello. So I've just finished a coaching session with one of my wonderful clients and I wanted to do a video about this topic because it comes up all the time with my clients and it comes up in my life too. We have to walk towards the fire. We have to walk towards the things that scare us the most. We have to walk towards situations that might trigger some of those painful memories from our childhoods. For example, we walk towards visibility. We walk towards relationship. But we don't do so unprotected, unsupported. We don't do so like a vulnerable child. We do so with support, with healthy foundations, with a strong connection to ourselves, hopefully supported by friends, possibly by a professional, so that it's a different experience. We can walk towards the things that wounded us the most, a relationship, an experience of being seen, but we can do so with support, so the outcome is different. We don't end up scarred, we don't end up wounded. Perhaps somebody might say something that we don't like and it hurts, or perhaps the relationship ends and it hurts, but it doesn't floor us like it did when we were little. It doesn't leave us so wounded that we don't want to go back out there and try again. So if you can build your healthy foundations and if you can be well supported, you can keep walking towards the fire. You can keep having experiences that are terrifying and surviving them, not only surviving them, but thriving through them. So this is the work that I do and I absolutely love it. And um, I am starting my Laying the Foundations course again very soon. So if you're interested in my How to Fall in Love Laying the Foundations course, please get in touch and I will support you to walk towards the fire and the outcome will be so different to what it was before. Thanks for watching. Bye.